All right, we have another rush deck here. So this is going to be a green yellow self damage rush. So you may have seen green yellow self damage before, but usually it's done in a control style. And uh, this one, instead, we're using the lands to rush to face. So it's quite similar to a regular self damage deck, apart from a few different changes. So we have the Llama Corn here used for not just card draw, but also we can use it to make sure we don't take too much damage and accidentally get ourselves into a lethal range. We also have Orndin Monk for the draw that we very much need, as well as a very nice rush addition in the yellow color. Everything else is pretty similar. We have Ultra Souls and Weeping Idol to help us generate some Faria and adding some very much needed weight to our hand. This deck runs Skyward Swordfish instead of the Adventurer since it requires one less forest, so we don't have to make too many lands in this deck. And although it doesn't potentially have as high health as the Wild Avenger, it is one fairy cheaper and we are valuing the tempo a bit more since this is a rush deck. You want to start with forest first every single time since you only need one and the creatures that you play don't need to be played on forest. And we also, the Weeping Idols of Structure doesn't need to be played on forest either. After that, if you're going first, you can double neutral and then make your three deserts. But if you do have a Kaleem's Training in your hand, then you can possibly set up for a turn free Monk, or you can play a Demon or Llama Corn turn free, and then with Kaleem's Training, you can go face turn four and add a lot of pressure very early on. Well, I've never played against this guy before. Okay. So, possibly could keep this. Maybe we want to, like, look for... Oh, it probably wasn't prayer. I guess we can double neutral next time. Bloated Toad. Pretty okay to Llama Corn, right? Or should we Demon first? I think we should Demon first and then Llama Corn. Whoa. Strange. Oh, Legends. Wait, what are we getting from Legends again? Oh, we can't even um, demon right now. What are we getting from this again? Oh, radiance. Okay. So I guess we just llama corn now. I like trading the blood to Toad. Before hitting face. Loonfish is also kind of crazy. What's this? Oh, I like that. That's kind of fun. Okay. How are we dealing with this? 
guess we can just hit first and see. Okay. I kind of like one of them monk here. So we can we can we can pray as well. Training is cool. We can kill this uh Grandeur now. And we can set up the annoying that. Oh, we didn't pray. Fortunate. Oh, I guess we want to save this monk for next turn anyway. Oh, that's nice. Should draw first. Alter of Souls is nice. Let's see, can he RNG this? Done. I don't think he can. I don't think it's possible. Oh, he went back to kill the altar, okay. That's interesting.
Oh, I'm pretty enjoying this deck a little bit actually. Yeah, I guess we need a double neutral because of the weeping idols, right? Because if we just build like um, the necessary lands we have, we don't have a lot of space to summon creatures, and oh, got me, and have the and have the um, the structures. We need to start doing stuff. Oh no, no, I didn't mean to do that. Never mind though. Guess it may have been okay because he does have Mirror Phantasm, so uh, he didn't have enough Ferrier. It's okay. Uh, hopefully you can't clear this demon. Not bad, eh? Oh. I 
philosophy's hard. Yeah, absolutely. That's why I didn't want to. Uh, that's why I did not really want to do it. Ikwe joining as a spectator, but you're watching the stream. Why? Pigway, why? Oh, it's a burn deck, guys. This might be tricky. Should we wait for turn three when we can play like loads of shit? More fair in the bank. That's only if we get our weeping idols out. Okay. Well, we do have Llama Corm out, out now. I want to see if we can draw Weeping Idol. There we go. Let's Prayer as well. So, two Weeping Idols. Save one of them. Oh, Derelict Tower is quite painful for us. Flame Burst Cypher is rough. Oh, okay. That's not great for him. Should we get rid of this derelict tower? I think it's going to be better for us in the long run, but then we don't get... We don't get to do 6 damage. his face or well, four damage I guess because it heals two He's already used two flame bursts.
you think that was too hasty or we could have waited a bit longer for that radius to come out? I think it's okay, right? Because with, with burn, you don't want to be too low on health. But at the same time, it's quite a monk ass that we took out so early. I'm going to hit face and prayer. We can swordfish as well. We don't really need to slaughter. Do we need to alter? All right, okay, so that's... All right, straight into the first game. Exio. We have a line, please. <laughs> okay. We we can I think we can keep this. The idea is probably weeping idol. I think we don't double neutral this this time. We just weeping idol desert desert play the shaitan demon. Hey uh hey Moldy Buffalo, we we're I'm playing the the rush deck the the self harm rush. Hmm. This is a bit tricky now. I think we just we let's play it how we would play it anyway and see what he does. Oh the prophet. Everyone's calling you Arnold now. Well, I didn't even say that what when I said it. I didn't say Arnold. I said Almond like the the, the nut <clears throat> Is he gonna trade this? He doesn't trade it, okay mm. In that case we can like Kaleem's training forest and oh, no, Kaleem's training desert again and then swordfish the the water elemental. Do you think we can like triple weeping idol? Is that Is that good? This seems quite crazy actually, I don't know if I like this. But even if he has building removal, it's fine because I'd rather the weeping idol gets removed than like the altar of souls. The only problem is that I kind of actually want one of these to be removed at some point because I need space for the altar of souls. You know, 
That's a good trade for me. I don't mind that. He needs to clear this now. Double Ninja Toad, that is kind of crazy. This is what I mean when we need the Altar of Souls. We need the space for the Altar of Souls. Do get a lot of fairy though. It's good. Don't actually have to worry about collecting too much now. But like the draw would have been nice if you know what I mean. Hopefully we don't have to draw any more. Tide Lord is huge. Llama Corn. Go crazy. Draw as well. Double Llama Corn. Should we kill the Tide Lord with this slaughtering shadow and then just play both Llama Corns? You get so much fairy, it's kind of crazy. That's all of his ninja toads. He has no humbling vision. So we could probably clear the the frog. Kind of like thinking if we should play like two slaughtering shadows this turn, make a land instead of drawing. But I think we should draw and see. I think drawing's right here. Okay. So we don't get to play two, but. Well, we could. Oh, shit. Yeah, Ninja Toad not great though. Radiance pretty. It's not really what we want, right? Of course it has to be radiant, it can't be anything else, right? <laughs> I just can't believe this this thing like it works like as a rush. I would have never have thought about it like this. I have to make another desert. It's like there's there's no other way about it. Oh my god, Empress combined on the two fairy slaughtering shadow. No way. 
I really want to make this desert now because I need to be playing these slaughtering shadows. So I've got to make one here, really. Um, we've got to trade this. Okay, this is kind of good now. I think I want to use the monk to clear this toad. Even though it's like bad value. Just so I have the space to play this swordfish. And like the rest of these shadows. I'm gonna. In terms of it doesn't making bad decks, like this deck probably isn't. It depends on what you mean by bad, like because this deck isn't great. Probably you need to find some matchups that suck against it, but I think every deck he's made has filled some sort of hole. It like works in some sort of way. Like the boulder throw deck, I never really expected that to work, but somehow it just it's really good. Like it's just surprisingly good. This is crazy. I don't even care that he's double collecting because even though he's double collecting, I'll just outvalue him like crazy with the triple idol. It's just bonkers. Like, what is this? Like, honestly. I mean, using the free Ninja Toes like that probably wasn't the best thing to do. But he was super scared of my rush. Maybe he thought he was okay because he had the, the Prophet of Tides. Warrock in his car. <laughs> Thanks. If I was to drive my car for three hours on, if I was to drive for three hours on my car's new tune. This is a have a good stream. All right, thanks, Warrock. Swordfish. Let's get something good out. Okay.
I might have to change decks if he's going to keep running this. Yeah, I think Karasius Doomsday can can work as well. Storm spawn again. So hopefully he shouldn't really have the Chaos combo yet. If he has Biomaster, that's pretty shit for us. We were close, we saw, we saw Francis Town. Should we keep the training just to see if we can get... Weaving Idol is nice though, I, I want to get a creature. Llamacorn, this is a nice combo. It's a bit awkward going first. I mean, either way, we're playing this turn free, so it doesn't really matter what we do. Change deck. But wait, this is fine, we just don't play the Nat, right? Oh, we simply just don't play the Nat. Lizzie, did you miss Zorni's stream today? Too busy. Whoa. Wait, 
he's actually... He did it again, yeah. Madman did it again. Yeah, six hours of streaming. Guy's... <laughs> Guy's crazy! I know, this curve is so beautiful. I don't even have to play the nap. I would like to draw. Okay. Ritualist, okay. Swordfish, okay. Now we're cooking. Probably don't want to play the soul pack yet. I haven't seen worried about the burn so I only want to play it if it secures like something huge fireball Fine by me. Okay, I do, I do need to find something though. <laughs> I'm getting kind of worried. Uh, let's see, Ultra Souls, that's going to take me down to eight, six. If he kills. Play it to soak hellfire pings, okay. But yeah, don't activate it, yeah I get it. Another ritualist. I mean, it's, it's sad that we're getting like the gnats and the soul packs, which we don't need. Trading. Get something else. Oh no. I mean, you do get a lot of farrier from... Yeah, I think we have to trade the demon just so that we're not in the double flame burst range. Yeah.
I don't know, soldiering like in theory seems nice because then you get the health back as well, but we do have the llama corn for that purpose. So it may be a bit like it's just unfortunate that we're not getting our other llama corn. Ooh. Why is this pinging so slowly? Ooh. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. 